they will go to these countries and when they want to take over a place, so let's just say this country say, okay, I'm going to go to this other country and we're going to beat them in war and we're going to take their stuff. The interesting thing is that whenever they did that, the first thing they will always do is burn their books. Think about that. They go to the country, give me your whole library, we burn all your books. If I don't want you to grow, I'm going to take away your books. This is deep here. I'm going to take away your history. Why would I take away your books? Because if I take over your country and then you decide to go to your library and you start to read, you're going to say, wait a minute. 50 years ago, our country was oppressed and we overcame and now we got free. So now if I let you read that, you might get the courage to revolt against me. Knowledge is the key. They burn every book, give them new books. I told y'all a couple Sundays ago, they literally build prisons off of literacy rates. They literally determine how many prisons they build in the area based on third grade scores, reading scores. Think about this. 90% of inmates are illiterate. Knowledge is the key. When you go to anybody who's successful, I ain't just talking about money, I'm talking about marriage, I'm talking about spirituality, I'm talking about emotional health, don't just ask them for the result, ask them how they got there. Mm -hmm. 